four-man rush out of his own end zone. And the catch, Golden Tate all the way up to the 39. That goes back to a year ago when he was kicking for the Denver Broncos at mile-high altitude. Over the middle, and what a reception made by Theo Riddick. Down to the 41-yard line. Caught in the middle of the field. We'll watch the snap and the hold. Low again. And this one is good. 22 to 21. There is time for this Detroit Lion group to get down into field position for him to have an opportunity in a field goal to win this game. Right, he's the NFL record holder. 64-yard field goal for Denver. So Stafford of the Lions go to work, trailing by a point. Picking up a first down and more is Riddick. Stafford on first down. Throws, and it's complete to the tight end, Ebron. Watch this guy in the middle of the field. You've got one timeout left. That's Theo Riddick. Stafford throws, and it's caught by Jones. Riding the clock. Down to 12 seconds. Stafford wanted Jones to get out of bounds. Obviously, Lions will use their final timeout. The extra point from the left hash. Ball is placed down, and Prater's kick from 43 yards out is good. The Lions go back on top with four seconds remaining. From the 25, it's Matthew Stafford. Fires for Higby, and he's got him for a first down. Deep drop. Looking deep for Cooper Cup, right on cue, inside the 40 of Baltimore. Stafford to his second read, and it's Ben Skoranek making the catch. Handoff for Michelle, stretch to the edge, and he gets taken down. Defensive coordinator Wink Martindale, you got to imagine he's got something dialed up. On fourth down, Stafford slings, Beckham holds on. You see these guys talking here. They're responsible for that bunch. Stafford rolls, throws, end zone. Beckham held on. Touchdown. Rams lead. Here is Stafford. They do have three timeouts remaining. Throws over the middle. Completes the pass to Marvin Jones. Remember, because of that extra point, they need a touchdown. There's two guys on the planet that can make that throw. Stafford and the other one lives in Green Bay. Off the back foot, sideways, falling away. Stafford stepping up. Stafford's going to run. He's got the first down. Stafford over the middle. Caught. Andre Roberts inside the 20, down to the 18. Stafford completes to Bolden to the end zone. Touchdown! Anquan Bolden! Todd Gurley to the goal line. Touchdown! I think he thought about waiting and letting the clock run out. Gave Detroit the narrow lead, but now they have to play catch up. Stafford's throw for Galladay and out of bounds. Hawkinson trying to get out of bounds. So the, the Falcons are trying to keep him wow. in bounds, and they do wow. without a timeout. That was a big defensive play. Stafford knows the situation here. Sidearm throw and an excellent catch. Stafford, middle of the field. Catch made, sliding inside the 10. The official says yes. What kind of pressure do they put on Matthew Stafford? 
He has time. Hesitates, throws, touchdown, Lions! And TJ Hawkinson. And I have to tell the audience that joined us that my guy Brock Heward said, do not give Matt Stafford this ball back. The extra point. And there's a flag down as the Lions rush the field. Here's a snap. Rush coming off the back foot and a connection. And Stafford still manages to throw a fall away jumper right on the money. It's amazing how I many he's completed off his back foot. Another check down. Another catch. Throwing the ball inside into the middle of the field. Yeah, the Browns playing cover eight. They're rushing three. They'll let him run. Side downs the ball. First down. He's at the top of your screen, Calvin Johnson. Stafford fires hard, makes a connection, gets his tight end, Pettigrew. Question of whether or not they're going to try to stick this thing in that hole to Calvin Johnson. First down throw. Set the clock ticking. 13. It's going to be 9 or 10 by the time this is killed. Wow, 8. Down to 8. Here's Stafford. Clock ticking down. On the run. He's in trouble. Stafford trying to elude a sack. He's going to let it fly. He has to. Still alive. Ball to the end zone. Jump ball. Intercepted by the Cleveland Browns. Flag. Flag. Two flags. Interference call. The game cannot end on a defensive penalty. And it was in the end zone. Oh, man. Stafford shaken up. He's up. Pass interference. Rob Ryan is up. He's, he's about 20 yards onto the field. Stafford in the end zone. Well, they're calling it on Ball Detroit. Ball yes. the one-yard line. Stafford. So this is it. One last play for the Lions and for the Browns. Wow. All right. Gets it in. They win it. Cleveland wins it with a stop. One yard to gain. Throw. Touchdown, Detroit. They did it. The Lions came back and did it. But the Lions find a way back. They were down at one point by 21 points. And that was in the first quarter. 6.13 to go. Four-point game. Rams start from the 21-yard line. Caught. And this time, can he get the first down? No. And here comes a huge call by McVay. Fourth and one. Cup. He's going to get it. And more. Stafford surveying. Straight drop. Fires. Caught. Cup. Third and two. They go no huddle. To the outside. And they hit Hopkins again. That Deep, deep drop. Swings it to the outside. Gain of a couple this time. Stafford. Caught on the run. Cup. Who else? Comes out of the slot to the right. Looks that way. Fires that way. Cup. Final play before the two-minute warning. On the ground. Akers this time. Finds the perfect time to finally do something on the ground. This is the 15th play of the drive. Four runs, 10 passes. Second and goal. Pass. Cup! Got it. Touchdown. Al, I've got to tell you. In a pressure situation, I don't know if I have ever seen anybody be better than Matthew Stafford and Cooper Cup. They had no choice. That was the entirety of their passing game, and they got it done for the go-ahead. Is completed to Calvin Johnson on the 37. 
Stafford going deep. And Durham has it. Chris Durham. Tremendous play. It's rare to get a go route on the outside against a loose cover defense like this simply because of the safeties playing a little wider. This is an unbelievably accurate throw gift from the football guys. 40 yards. And here is Stafford's pass and Calvin Johnson stopped at the one yard line. The Detroit Lions. No timeouts left. Time is running. They're at the one and Stafford says come on in. Reaches over. Touchdown! Here is Akers, and he gives Detroit the lead, 31 to 30. They're under pressure now. Major. We have a field goal kicker that was just short from 47 yards. Rams just had to take a timeout, so they're out of them right now. Second and 11. See if we can get a drive starter going. Stafford. Deep downfield. He's got cut. He's got to get out of bounds, and he is able to do that. It's the quick twitch motion at the top of this route. Watch what happens. Cup with a little double, triple move. Drops the defender to the ground. And he does get out. Stafford. Deep downfield. He's got Cup again. He's at the 10. Stafford says, let's get down there. We got we to gotta clock it. We got to get the field goal. Clock running down. They have time. Rams getting set. Getting ready for Matt Gay to come in. He spikes it there, and Matt Gay will come in and try to win the game. Safety on the back end, Antoine Winfield has to cover Cooper Cup. The triple crown winner of receivers, one-on-one -on -one down the field, and Stafford finds him and hits him. As I said before, if Cooper Cup doesn't wind up in the top five of the MVP balloting, it's a crime. 30 yards to win the game. Matt Gape boots it through.